Hi hey everyone, it's Overlord73 and we are back playing some more The Last Story on Nintendo Wii. We're back in the end, so let's go and uh, see who's around and if there's any conversations to be had. Little lad's asleep, so we'll leave him be. Didn't come here to play around. Don't dilly dally too long. Dilly dally. Our next job should be confirmed tonight. We'll talk about it tomorrow. It's getting pretty late. You should sleep. That sounds like a mighty fine idea. Let's get some Zeds then. Got our new orders. What is it this time? I'm sick of fighting those lizard things. We're doing guard duty at Lazulus Castle. A bit more appealing, eh? Not bad. The Count's throwing a ball. He's invited all the cities rich and powerful, and they don't have the manpower to cover it. <laughs> I bet there'll be some classy drinks on offer. We're heading off as soon as you're all ready. Got that? Ready. Ready to go? No. Hurry up then. We don't have all day. I wonder if the castle has a library. I do love visiting libraries. But I suspect I wouldn't be allowed. I suspect not. Sounds quite boring actually. A ball, eh? Sounds fun. No one will mind if I take a few little hors d'oeuvres, right? Oh, she's going to be trouble. find them for you. Guard duty? Sounds boring. Hopefully I can just stand outside on my own. Yeah, you do that. So a quick look. Is anybody down downstairs? A string plucked too often is destined to one day break. No matter how sweet the song, it sometimes needs a few bars of rest. Yeah, okay. Oh, Zale, I made something good for lunch. Here, do you want some? You don't have to eat it right away. But when you do, tell me how it is. And don't let Marania get her hands on it. She'll scoff the lot. She asked so nicely. Then I gave her one, then another, and another. It was bad. I'm always in for a free lunch, thank you very much. Ready to go? Okay, yep. Yeah. Then let's head to the castle. To the castle it is. Oh, this is a swanky place. Count Argonans abode. The wedding was but one month away, and the whole castle was filled with excitement and anticipation. After all, the great houses of Argonon and Rambolt were to be joined in holy matrimony. Such a momentous occasion was the focus of the entire empire. Wow, would you look at that? Well, I'll tell you, this Argonon chap is no slouch. Seren, 
Stop gawping like an idiot. The ball is due to start soon. There could be feuding nobles together in the same place. So take care that nothing unfortunate happens. Sure thing. Soren, try not to show off your complete lack of class, eh? Shut your pie hole. You're a fine one to talk. A knight. What's up? I was just thinking. I've got a long way to go. Ah, oh, you mean the knights? They're in a different league to us. People may fear us mercenaries, but they look down on us too. I'll join them. Someday. <laughs> dream on, mate. It's no dream. Follow me and I swear I'll make knights out of all of you. I know you will. A knight in shiny armor. need to sort out a few things here before the ball. You can go take a look around. Knowing the layout of the castle might come in handy. Oh yeah. If you want to go back, show this to the guard at the gate. We have a castle pass, aren't we, Lucky? Well, let's have a wonder. I last saw Lady Callista when she was a mere slip of a girl. I'm sure. Can you tell me what colour dress Lady Callista will be wearing? I'm sorry, my lady. I do not know. Can you tell me what colour? Can you tell me what colour dress Lady Callista will be wearing? That's a bit irritating. Can you tell me what? Yeah, same dialogue over and over. The courtyard ahead is so quiet and soothing. Is that one of your friends bellowing in the courtyard? Can't you do something? I can't leave my post. Well, it looks like I've got no choice. Let's go and see who it is. It's bellowing. It's probably Saran pissed up. Are you starting, mate? You want to say that to my face? Come on, then. Say it again if you're hard enough. Might have known. I heard the way you said mercenary just now. And? That is what you are, is it not? I'm saying I can't stand your holier-than-thou attitude. Your delightful manners are just what one would expect from a mercenary. Oh, you really want your ass kicked, don't you? Then bring it! Stay your blade. General Astar. You want some as well, you old git? <laughs> Lady mercenary. I apologize to you for my pupil's behavior. However, this is causing quite a spectacle. So would you humor me and leave your weapon sheathed? Sure, whatever. You've killed the mood now anyway. And I've got better things to do. Minor crisis averted. This day is a joyous one. We ought to enjoy it. Sir Therius, what were you thinking? No one would believe you were a knight if they saw you behave in such a manner. General. The public expects us to act with decorum at all times. To betray that trust is a great dishonor. My sincere apologies. <laughs> Raise your head, Therese. No need to look so depressed. My apologies, General. <laughs> you know, I just paid a visit to the castle barracks. I see. Your thoughts, General. Lazarus Island is too peaceful. The result? Knights who forget their swords. They think not of their duty, 
but only of themselves. I agree, General. The knights I see here are totally devoid of aspirations. Indeed, the mercenary we just met seemed much more adept as a swordsman. Quite. Therius. I am thinking of training another knight here. You wish to take on a new pupil? <laughs> Is that worry I hear? Fear not. I doubt anyone could surpass you. Therius, I feel that the cloying peace of this island hides something darker. If there is anywhere that requires honorable knights, is it not this island? Agreed. With each day that goes by, more pain is caused throughout the Empire by the land's decay. And this island is a key location. So having a knight here who the people can trust could ensure peace throughout the entire Empire. Indeed. So Therius, when that time comes, you must work together with that person. Yes, General. It will be as you wish. Therius, it's just you and me. No need to be so formal. As you command. Therius, I just said not to... No. No wonder you're not a hit with the ladies. Right, let's have a word with the silly cow. The city's nice enough, but the castle's filled with some right creeps. The city's nice enough, but the castle's filled with some right creeps. And she obviously doesn't want to say too much that about General what's just gone on. That General Astar. Now there's a man who deserves respect. He wields the mantle of authority well. He's the true model of a knight. What's down this way? Not a great deal, I don't think. Well, that will be the main gate. Well, I don't want to go out. Not yet, anyhow. Entry is forbidden to all but knights. Leave immediately. Okay, asshole. woman raising her voice in the castle like that indeed what's the matter are you lost this is my first time here as well sometimes I get lost hey Therius general I'm sure one of the servants would guide you if you asked and make me look like a fool certainly not so you see if you're seeking a guide you might wish to look elsewhere He doesn't want to talk much either. I heard General Astar is searching the castle for something. I heard it's something to do with the decaying of the lands within the Empire. Let's go back into the hall. Seren's flashed her fangs, eh? She excels at making trouble. By the way, I think Dagron's all done with the preparations. Second floor, you say? Who's this guy? How did the ruler of one little island end up with a castle as grand as this? He's got to be hiding something. There'll be a criminal.
Bound to be a criminal. Drugs baron, maybe. Arms smuggling. We finished sorting out the details. Are you ready, Zayon? Yep. Right. Time for work. Don't let me down. Would I? <laughs>